this outside shot's going to be a little quick because it's raining. <laughs> So here's 1751 Ascot. Uh, the main thing I want to point out is we're really, really close to a major road. You can see all the cars going by up there and hear them as well. Uh, otherwise, it's not too bad here. We also have thunder. <laughs> uh, this home looks like it got a newer sewer line. That's what these are for. We had went through the sidewalk to get it. So brick with the vinyl top, and let's take a look inside. Okay, steel insulated door, and they have tiled the entry. That's what I recommend for Montrose. You can do it any kind you want. And then there's carpet beyond here. Place is freshly painted. I don't think they're even done working on it, maybe. So that looks like a new or newer window. Tile floor here in the kitchen, and I'm not finding the light switches. Oh, there it is. <clears throat> and this is a granite top. I think that's Uba Tuba is the type of granite. Granite's far superior than the appliances, but they'll work. GE here. There and a mana on the dishwasher. I'd be tempted to change this to uh, a door to go out. Totally would do that. Yeah. So let's move on. I did not get the lights on first, I apologize. And here we have coat closet. And looks like a brand spanking new water heater. And they put a drain pan in it, but the pipe doesn't go anywhere, but that's okay, it's code. <laughs> so, here's the bathroom. And it's an older top, cultured marble, but still okay. Not perfect. But, uh, yeah, you'll end up doing something here. But they put the laundry in the bathroom. And the cold needs a knob replacement. The tile is in need a little help here. And the tub is, is, is older and the finish is a bit worn. I would recoat or maybe do redo the thing. I don't think they finished painting in there either, by the way. And here's the furnace, popular model in this area, pain. It's not the original and not brand new, but it works. Carpet smells like they installed it yesterday. <laughs> so we got a closet here in this bedroom and one over there. So this probably be qualified as the master. And I'll probably be shooting the outdoor shots through the windows because of the, um, it's raining pretty good. So hopefully that's not a problem. That may, this one's easy to see. I'll get a little more. And linen closet here, final bedroom facing the front. You can see the rain just drove on these windows. I want to make sure the seal's not broken on that. It's hard to tell. And I don't know if I did this bedroom. Okay. No, I didn't. So this one's a little tight. So the one bedroom's larger and the other two were smaller. And if I didn't get it, ceiling fan in here. That's the master ceiling fan. All the bedrooms have ceiling fans that are newer. And that's often done in lieu of air conditioning. So all that's left is taking a look at here.
We get a garage on this one. Garage door looks like it's okay, don't see any damage. No light switch in here. There it is. Okay. So, no light. <laughs> but it's a garage. So, concrete looks to be in good shape. They put a coating on it at some point. And here's another view of the back with the trellis. There's a box in the corner that has a phone line and somebody ran a new wire not buried in the ground from there so they probably had a problem with the line. And here's where I would put a door have to re relocate some sprinkler plumbing and they left put the control out here. I would change that. But anyway, we're getting wet. I think that's it on this house. So, you know, all in all, not too bad. It's actually, I've, to me, it feels better than it looked in the pictures. But I think the, the main thing working against it, as I mentioned before, is the, uh, the road noise is louder on this side. So, yeah. So, but the back wasn't so bad. One thing I think I may have missed in the original video is it looks like the tile uh, needs a little work right here at the entrance to the bathroom. You've got a cracked tile and cracked grout and a couple strips in there looks like a different tile. So I didn't see that before. I just caught it when I was turning lights off. So anyway, I thought you should see that. Okay, one of the challenges I have with showing homes video style in the rain is, well, I tend to rush sometimes the outside. So I want to point out there's some minor damage. It almost looks like hail damage to the vinyl siding at the front. It's more noticeable around the garage door. Um, and I think I see some over at the far right end as well. It might have been insurance claim, but that's something I would bring up to the listing agent to tell the seller that, you know, they should have uh, repaired, replaced that on the insurance with the roof. So anyway, I want to point that out to you. And by the way, the tree in front looks pretty good. <laughs> there.